we're currently faced with a situation where we only have three northern white rhino left. One is an old male by the name of Sudan. He is 43 years old, makes him about a hundred and something if he's a human. Um, so he's old and he's infertile and he certainly is not capable of breeding. But the two females are also infertile, but they are the last single repository of uh, northern white rhinoc rhinoceros eggs left on the planet. And at the moment, there is no way of preserving their, uh, their eggs uh, should they die. Okay? So if they were to die, then our chances of using the artificial reproductive techniques that are going to be necessary to recover these, this species it would be lost. And, and that technique that I'm referring to is in vitro fertilization. So that's removing eggs from the females when we have the technology and protocol to mature those eggs successfully and create embryos using stored northern white rhino semen from around the world. Um, so keeping them alive is clearly an imperative for us. There is a consortium of people uh, across Europe and in South Africa who are working with zoo bred uh, and held animals to, to develop IVF, to develop the techniques to remove eggs and create embryos uh, in vitro. They have so far been successful at removing eggs. They have yet to be successful uh, at maturing the embryos to the point uh, of becoming a blastocyst, which allows those embryos to be successfully frozen. And they reckon that they are on the point of being able to do that, whereupon they will then be able to come and start, start to take eggs from the northern white females and, and storing their embryos. And once that is done, obviously one northern white rhino calf is not enough, we have to do it multiple times again to eventually create a founder population which could be bred against different lines to eventually allow repatriation of a founder population to the central uh, African habitat from where they came. The estimated total cost is about $10 million. You know, we've got a long way to go before that species is, is, is fully recovered. Any help we can get is massively welcome, uh, is required, and please keep up your efforts and we'll keep up our efforts to continue growing rhino populations.